Hello everyone, Nick Dangerbirds is here. Today is the tutorial on how to uh, install the old games on the old iPad. This is the iPad first generation. As you see, it's uh, running perfectly. I bought this from the 2010 and still it works perfectly from like a lot of years. And still you see, I have a lot of Angry Birds games installed by using his method which I'm gonna show you right now this is probably like the most uh, requested uh, requested one so I'm gonna do the tutorial on how to install all the Angry Birds uh, it may be Angry Birds or maybe other games you want to install all of the games inside the old iOS device so but Something I want to thing you tell you is that if you hear some background noises, so I'm sorry, just bear with it. So yeah, let's start the tutorial on how to install the IPF, I mean the the uh, uh, the games on the iOS device, the older versions. The first step is that you need to jailbreak the device you're using. This is because when there's a tweak known as App Sync that'll allow you to install the games on the iOS device. Otherwise, it won't work. So here, it's going to Cydia. Uh, wait for it to load. Mm, taking a bit of time. Here it is. Here's the Cydia. As you see, the sources is now refreshing, so um, it will be take a bit time to refresh the all of the repositories. I mean the sources right here. Just wait a bit. Um. Uh, you know what? Let's just see. Uh, the thing is that you have to install this one known as AppSync Unified. Thing. This will allow you to uh, install the sync all. I mean, uh, is, uh, I'll install the app all of the older apps in the device. The sources is available in Karen's.repo. Oh, yeah, it's refreshing. Wait. Return to Cydia. All right, so here is the Karens.repo. It's right here. Go to all packages, and here is the App Sync Unified. And it was installed fake iOS applications. This is only for iOS five and up. If you have iOS four, do you have to install the App Sync for iOS four point zero? That is only for iOS four, and this is for iOS five and up. So uh, my one is iOS 5 and 1, that is iOS 5.1.1. So you can, uh, I'm using the app Sig Unified. Now once you're done, you're ready to install the apps from the i, I mean from this one, iPad or any other devices. But you need to make sure that you enable app Sync. Even if you see that uh, the app Sync is still here, but your install, but your app is uh, failed to install. You have to either um, click on modify. If either you can remove it and reinstall it again, or you can reinstall it if you want to. So this is how you do that. Also, if you want the repository of the karens.repo i'm gonna give the repository in the description right here this is the repository http colon uh slash slash cdi.akb.ai i'm gonna still gonna give you the repository in the description so you can add the repository by click on edit and add like this they edit add here is so the cdi app to the url so you have to click on that karens ui uh, karens repository thing here right here click on add source and it'll allow you to do that so here you go this is how you do that make sure you keep it at uh, make sure you uh, enable it so that you can install the app sorry uh, this is how you do that on 
like this is how you uh, be ready to do the next step. Now the second step is that you, you have to use your PC and then use the cable charger connected to your iPad. In this case I'm using my charger cable with a 30 pin USB cable charger. It can be any charger cable or maybe you can use your cable, any type of cable you want. Now the first one you have to go is to Google Chrome search Angry Birds plus Bad Piggies collection. It'll shift you to this type of website archive website and if still the website doesn't work then you yeah, then it means you need a vpn in this case i'm using uh, i'm already using vpn now say for example i want to download a um, uh angry birds halloween version 1.0.0 hd version so gonna here's angry birds season hd and here is the HD 1.0.0 IPA file. Just click on the this one in order to download the game. So here it is. The game is downloading right here. Let's hear it here. It's downloading. Uh, I'm gonna wait for if the download finishes. Uh, I mean, I'm gonna wait until the download finishes. So bear, give some time for that. see that the IP is now installed. Now what you need to do is go to Cloud Explorer right here and also you need to go to iTunes. If you're on Mac, the iTunes will be on the Mac but on Windows you have installed. So here is the Universe Seasons 1.0.0 and And also you need to connect this one on to the iPad I just mentioned earlier and because there's a device icon it will show up and here is the device name over here now what you need to do is drag over there right on the device section and you see this one will be the blue box will appear right here and here we go let's wait for syncing to start right here it's waiting for change to apply for the online for the one. And here you see it is installing just wait a minute. Uh, it might take a bit of a time to copy the game. Depends on how much size the game is. Uh, wait a bit. Done. Now you see the game is installed and yeah, here we go. The game is finally installed and we can now play the game right now. Here is the game. So, so this is really a the, the, the this is really a nice thing to do. Go drag IP on the device and then it will go the same here, right over there and we can stop. So it's such a great thing and I did the for all of these my games. This is the one I do all the time. Alright, so now the installation of this is done. Now let's test the game, whether it works or not. Sometimes the game might crash. Who knows? Let's see. Angry Birds Halloween HD version. The Rovio logo. Game Halloween. Here we go. Uh, Halloween HD Yep, this is probably the one the first version of the Angry Birds seasons Until it was changed to Angry Birds season before it was at Halloween Same goes to the Angry Birds Classic 1.0 This was named nothing Just Halloween so let's get started with this. Just play a bit like three levels and then I'm done. Okay. And here is the iconic cutscene. That got removed in two, I mean, probably on Piglantis update if I remember correctly. I'm not sure though. 
So, there's the game. I mean, here's the tutorial. So, here's the birds. Start. Only one hit, only one shot with the bird. Probably the first level, the same like the classic, English classic version 1.0. The bird is the first level, only one pig, and three birds. This one only has, this one has like four, I believe. Yeah. Three stars, new high score. What a good one. Second level. Oh, getting the fun playing this one. Again, three stars. What a nice one. Here's the blue tutorial. Wow. Oh, come on. One pig left, seriously? That's a bit of a wonderful shot. Right there. there we go. That's more I like it. Eh, here we got two stars. Nah, no matter. So let's exit the game. So here we go. The Angry Birds Hellway. Here you got the stars. How many stars we got? Here is the score, total score from the uh, levels we just cleared right now. So yeah, this is the uh, Angry Birds Halloween, the first version of Angry Birds Season, version 1.0. Although in the IPA file it's like, like 1.0.0 But, oh well, same thing though Anyways, this is the game Uh, really nice game for, you know, in my opinion Really good stuff for Halloween Now uh, one thing you should make sure is that most of the IP files does not support on this uh, device of most of them. Like for example, that, I mean the modern ones, especially some old ones that does not support it. So for example, I downloaded the Angry Birds Epic version 1.0.0 IP file, it's a long version. If I drag it onto this one, it will say this error. The app, this one, the IP file, was not installed on the IP version because it requires a new version of iOS because since it's a newer version, it requires a newer version of iOS, so it definitely needs to, uh, you need to buy another newer version of iOS. Like for example, if you want an iPad 2 or 3 or more modern devices. This one it only supports from lower to, from, to lower to iOS 5, so you can't update, you cannot update more, mm, cannot update anymore with this one. So yeah, this is the thing you need to know about it. So another method of Downloading the version of the app, even downgrading the apps. I'm still learning how to do that, so I don't know. So, if you enjoyed this tutorial, be sure to like, subscribe, press the bell for more videos, and comment down below if you have any issues with that. And follow that on my reply for the issues. Thank you for watching, and I will see you on the next video. Here we go, let's Adios.